Now from Place Ministries, another inspirational moment. Welcome back to your place. 2 Samuel 7, 7 says, In all the places where I have moved with all the people of Israel, did I speak a word with any of the judges of Israel whom I commanded to shepherd my people Israel, saying, Why have you not built me a house of cedar? You'd be hard-pressed to find anyone as passionate about God in the Bible than David. With that being said, sometimes David's passion got ahead of God as it did in this passage in 2 Samuel 7. For example, David, while in his permanent residence as king, he couldn't stand the fact that God's dwelling place was still temporary and David wanted to build God a permanent temple in which to dwell. The prophet Nathan told David to follow his heart, but that is not what God told David to do. Oftentimes our passion tells us what we should be doing for God, but we really have to be careful to understand there are times our heart gets ahead of God, even if it is in the purest of intentions. God's desire for David was to spend time shepherding his people. It is how God equipped David when he was a young boy. Building the temple was God's plan for Solomon, and God's plan for David was to continue to be a shepherd. As you live out your place in life and ministry today, make sure your heart doesn't get ahead of God. Take time to pray, to seek His Word, and then, and only then, when God gives you the green light, go at it with all your heart. Ultimately, we must yield to the direction of the Lord, but don't fret. He's never late and he's never wrong. Your Place is a weekday devotional from Place Ministries. Our focus is helping followers of Christ know how and why God created them and be encouraged to do what God created them to do in life and ministry. For a list of free resources, go to placeministries.org. And join us every weekday right here at Your Place.